G'day everybody, it's your boy Cheru47 here, and today we're jumping into Hitman 3's first DLC, The Seven Deadly Sins. And what better sin to start with than with greed? After all, when I click on greed right here and assume that I already own it, because I own every single Hitman game both on Steam and on the Epic Store, it tells me that I still need to buy it even though I already have the deluxe edition that was like 30 extra dollars for a couple of crappy suits. So I come over to the Epic Store, I click View Offers, assuming that it's going to give me a great offer, like uh, making me pay an additional $45 after the deluxe edition that was 100 Hundred <laughs> and that's after the discount. 130 bucks for the deluxe. God damn it. And that's all it took, boys. An additional $45, and now we've got access. Here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Ho hold on. Hold on. I just paid $7.50 for a mother. 47. Wake up! I don't want to die, Anna. This is the worst nightmare ever. I just paid 45 Australian dollars for DLC. <laughs> It's nothing more than an escalation. So it looks like my first objective is to eliminate Teresa Salas by snapping their neck. There. Oh, okay. Well, that's very progressive. We're not even referring to women as women. Okay. All right. Uh, excuse me, lady. There's a global pandemic going on right now. You you should... Oh, that's my walking stick. How to get over here? You should not be pressing that button. If Hi there. Oh, it's a very deep voice you've got there. Can you get out of my face, please? <laughs> I'm not in your face. Also, lady, there's some... Thick le and like you've got nice legs. That's all I'm saying. Hi there, sir. Oh, I see what's going on. Everyone's voice is distorted because this is a bad dream. This is a bad dream. Okay, well, yeah, it is. But the show must go on. How you going, lady? I'll just grab a nice glass of that champagne. Probably wasn't. I wasn't meant to do that, huh? Now, I'm not going to lie. It does feel a little bit awkward starting this mission without me saying I brought a couple of cheeky toys with me to help me get the job done, but I really haven't. I've only got this stick and I've got uh, my handy dandy little murder camera. Perfect for taking shots of people before you very inconveniently for them push them over the balcony. Whoopsie. <laughs> <laughs> that lady always gets it. She's such a good sport. Oh, wait, hold on a second. It seems like my target was right at the starting area all along. And Salas, Salas, Teresa Salas. Is that like that lady, Athena Savalas? Yeah, probably related. You need to finish them. Oh. Shao Kahn. <laughs> Is that you? Well, could you could you do the whole finish him thing? That's kind of cool. Finish him. Oh, sick. Thanks, bro. Take their coins. Oh, she's got coins. Okay. I'll take them, and then I'll very conveniently hide her under the staircase where she'll never be found for all of eternity. <laughs> Next up, it looks like I need to kill someone by the name of Hanako Katos, who also needs to have their neck snapped. There she is over there. Gee, I'm glad that IOI went down the creative route and decided to make all of these kills really kind of unique. All right, so I'm very stealthily going to sneak through here, choke this guy out, and then very conveniently deposit his body in the elevator shaft. And I'm going to come over here, look at this lady, and think to myself, hold on. Hold on just a second. Hold on just a second, lady. Oh. <laughs> she face planted that Coke machine pretty hard. I mean, besides the very obvious fact that there's a film grain added to this and I'm wearing a gold suit and the start of the level had coins all over the place, this is literally exactly the same level as the regular Dubai. Nothing has changed at all. Hey, Hanako Katos, are you aware that Hanako is actually a girl's name in Japanese and you're an Indian dude? But hey, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Alrighty, next target, a man by the name of Lars Blocker. Hey, Lars, Blocker this. <laughs> <laughs> and now for my final trick. What? Hold on, that... But, that that's, that was a that was a pretty lethal throw. All right, well, considering that lethal throw failed miserably, I can only assume that it means... Oh, lady. What do you think you're... I can only assume that it means a lethal throw with an object that lethally renders them lethal or something. I'll just take that. I'll be taking all of these coins right here. Thank you very much. There's a lot of them. My God, you'd be balling, bro. Uh-oh. You guys picked a fight that you were destined to lose. So now apparently I can leave, but first I'm going to head back to the start of this level, stuff a couple of coins in the frog's mouth and see what happens. Oh god, I'm pretty sure I'm just going to end up dead at this point. Excuse me, sorry, I just need, need, need a wardrobe to hide in for a second. Target is lost, I repeat, <laughs> target is lost. That's why you get paid the big bucks, buddy. Surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Froggy, I hope you're feeling hungry. Mmm. Bear it... I don't need or want this. Well, this is a lot of fun. Wow, I unlocked a coin. Oh, wow. Oh my god, I got a new gold suit that I'm never going to wear. Oh my god. Oh, and I got a stick. Whoa, this is so great. You like the coins. 
No, not really. All right, well, it looks like my first objective is to eliminate Namama Bababa, and Namama Baba is right here inside of this. Oh, hold on, with a lethal throw. If I'm not mistaken, I do have a couple of coins left in my pocket, so I'll just stuff them in here and I'll. Uh... Nope. Oh, all right. Well, I guess I'm not going to kill Namada Baba with an ice pick. I'm going to have to find something else. Hey, Namada Baba, I'll be back in a minute. Just looking for someone pointy <laughs> I can throw at you. All right, Namada Baba. Thank you for the coins. Don't forget the coins. I won't. Uh, that's literally the only reason we're here, right? Oh, wait, hold on. Eliminate Kelly Toby by dra- Oh, okay. All right. Now, this, this, this is right in my skill set. <laughs> Well, she's nowhere near a toilet. That's going to make things a little bit complicated, but I've got a good idea. After all, I've played this level so many times that I know everything off by heart. So I'll just scale this little doodah right here, hop up on this ledge, and then I'll stuff a bunch of medic rat poison in a water bottle. Mmm, you drink that all up, you dirty girl. Uh-oh, looks like someone's got a stomach upset. All right, now let's get this. Wow, look at that. The toilet seat even lifted itself up. That's great. Oh, there we go. a girl. That'll make you feel better. And by the way, got a message from, I don't know, your mum. And it's to always stay hydrated. That's right, you dirty girl. Drink it all up. Drink it all up. Drink it all up. This DLC is so awesome. I love it. Oh, she drank it all. Sorry, mate. It's nothing personal. Hell, it's not even the kill everybody challenge. It's just an extortionate DLC. Oh, hey, look at that. Is that... Oh, my God. Is that gold baller? Is that... Well, all right. Well, I'm super rich, so I'm... Oh, there we go. 15 coins. Booyah. Just uh, take that ICA 19 gold baller and uh, an electronic hacker key. Great. Great. That's... Wow, that's cool. His Royal Highness Omar al Shut your mouth. <laughs> I was going to say shut your mouth, but... All right, here we go again. This time being very careful not to unnecessarily smack anyone in the face with my walking stick. I am but a humble rich man sneaking into areas that I shouldn't be sneaking into. Completely normal for the super rich and wealthy. All righty, this time around, I'm going to come through here. Let myself in now that I've got a key scrap. Oh, uh, Google, what's the code for this door, please? 4706. All right, sweet. Four, zero, seven, six. All right, Google, you dumb... I said 4706, not 4076, you dumb f- Okay, alright, 4706. Thank you, sorry, that, that was your mistake. So I need to do this completely undetected, meaning that nobody is allowed to lay an eye on me. James called in six. Which also means that- hey! Bitch! Alright, so I'm guessing that maybe stealth is the better option this time. I won't attack anybody, I'll just very quietly wait, sneak, wait some more. Why? <laughs> Why are both of those cake machines smashed? Oh, hold on a second. Osama Tamir is the dude on the other side of the well. It's a shame I don't have the El Matador. <laughs> Otherwise, I just shoot you through this cement wall. Best way to do this is probably to pop a cap in him. Then him. Oh, got him before he was able to lay an eye on me. Suck a ding ding. Now it looks like I've got two more targets. Keiji Kono and Carl Thorne both to be eliminated with a pistol. So I'm pretty sure that one of them should be working. Here we go. The control panel right here in the special effects room. So I'm just gonna pop a cap in his banjueros. I'll just scoop up all of his coins. Oh, baby, think of all of the cans of Coca-Cola I can get after this mission. Oh, no. All the Coke machines are smashed. The good news, though, is that my other target is right inside of this room. Oh, my goodness. It's the... Oh, it's the helicopter. Oh, well, all right. There goes my getaway. Oh, and the other target's right there. Well, that's good. I can just sneak my way across here, climb up this ladder. And while he's busy fixing the air conditioning unit, I'm just going to say, hey, bro. That's, that's all I'm going to say. Just, hey, bro. <laughs> and it uh, looks like that. That's everybody. All right. Well, time to get out of this place. God, this was a riveting DLC. So glad I paid $7.50 for it. I've got a boner right now. Oh, my respect for IOI has just like <laughs> gone so down. Ah, oh, just don't, don't buy it, guys. Don't, do not. Biggest waste of money ever.